Thunder Forest. What's up, Rain and Wrenches? Your man Booby here. Craig's not here, he's probably still at work. That's all right. Uh, haven't shot a video in a while, and we'll be putting up some uh, videos after this one of an update to Scarlet here, and an update to Annabelle. There's a couple things we've done to Craig's bike, and then a couple things we're in the process of doing to his bike. Uh, so, first of all, let's get started with the quick drink. Always gonna have your favorite beverage with you. And today uh, I'm gonna be putting in this uh, battery tender cable on a Scarlet, uh, just in case for any reason, I haven't had any issues so far, but for any reason that I would have to uh, jump it, charge it, whatever the case may be, I can do that. But I also found out too, when I was not even looking, that this is loose. So I'm gonna end up tighten that up too. But uh, first off, what we have to do to install the battery tender cable is take the front fairing off, front grill, chin strap, whatever you want to call it, or uh, chin guard, and uh, get to the battery itself. Uh, cut to the next scene after that. Uh, well, I want to stop here a second, but quick update of. The last thing I've done to Annabelle since the last video, I think, is the handlebars. So, you see, I've raised the handlebars up quite a bit. These are the uh, Kong handlebars from Witch Doctors. I think they're the Mighty Kongs. Uh, I have a video on that I'll be putting up. You can scan through the videos to uh, get to that one. Uh, don't know how soon it's going to go up, but it's going to go up. And uh, there's probably two or three other videos that I need to put up, but... Just haven't haven't got around to it. This YouTube thing, me being at work all the time. Just haven't got around to it. But I'm off for 30 days, so I got some time to work on it. But yeah, so I will stop here and cut to when I get the chin guard off. Alright, and cut to fair and being off. So uh here is the front chin grill, or the front grill, and the side cover. So the side goes here, the grill goes on the front. Um, what I did is I had to take out a bolt here, a bolt down here, actually, bolt here, and there's another bolt under here. So there's three bolts and the side cover. And then attached to the side cover is the radiator. So I took a uh, just a nut off this side it has a, uh, a bolt on there that goes through here and then the bolt that goes on to hold the radiator in place so it doesn't we'll go around so the next thing i'm gonna do is take off the battery connections put on those connections and then run it under the radiator under to right here that way it stays under this cover, stays hidden. That way, then if I ever have to use it, I can pull it out, plug it in, charge it, jump it, whatever I need to do. And then, put it back under there so it's not sitting out exposed like on uh, some other bikes. Like, uh, not the dog Craig's Harley, but Craig's Harley has it coming out, the side cover right here, so. Yeah, but I mean, just aesthetically, it's gonna look better under the cover because you won't be able to see it. And then, yeah, so I'll stop here and then go cut to the next part of the video where I actually have it on. And we're back. So, uh, real quick and easy, what I did is I took the negative connection off, the black side, put that side on first. And then took the red side off, which is the positive side, and put that side on. And let's see if there's some light in here. There we go. So uh, ran this, so let's refuse that. Ran this under the radiator. Back up under this cover. And then these sit right here. Then if you need it, you just grab it, pull it out, 
use it when you don't need it. It's kind of hard to do with one hand. Tuck it back up under there. And that's just where it sits. And then the side cover. side cover will cover all this up so you will never know what's under there but that's how you do that just that quick and easy now to put everything back together oh quick update I went ahead and uh, tighten that up I didn't have any red thread locker down here with me but I will take it back off and put a red thread locker on it and then tighten it back up but it is definitely on there now so uh, that's going to be the video for today. I'm going to go ahead and put all this back together and uh, make sure she runs. <laughs> well, actually, we can do that real quick and see if it pops on. There we go. So, yeah, we're all good there. Uh, yeah, other than that, quick and easy. Putting a battery tender connection on. Uh, but be on the lookout for more videos. They're coming. I just have to go ahead and edit them but on that note booby out craig would be out too but he's at work so uh next video we might be doing actually his bike is under his seat he's getting a solo seat he picked up a, a free solo seat from his dad uh so we're actually gonna make a plate to go under his seat and then bolt on his uh, solo seat so that'll be an update on his bike when we get to it and for now that's it i'm gonna get off here and put all this shit back together